Sneaking a toffee apple flavored Tim Tam before boot camp. Boot camp starts in like 15 minutes. Just gotta get my sugar head in. I just gotta, I just gotta do it. I just gotta do it. I just had to come back and get my camera because it went flat. I quickly chucked it on charge while I was doing school drop off. Okay, off to booty. I love wait sessions. I love my morning sessions. I'm home. I've had some oats. It was a good workout. It was a really good workout. It was like our chest and arms. A lot of push-ups. It's cold again. I'm just going to jump in the hot shower. I do parent help at school today, so I always like helping out. Just because I like seeing Nazoni doing schoolwork and being told by the teacher what to do and her actually listening because she doesn't do that at no, she does do that at home. Just sometimes. Not all the time. So now I'm just gonna clean up, do some dishes, fold the washing, just the normal everyday shit that I do. There's not much dishes. Um, those are like clean. Those actually need to be put away. I had a banana with my oats too. And I just need to fold that little bit of washing. Probably put on some more washing. Need to uh, fold this towel away. I mean, <laughs> blanket. It's been there since the weekend. When we have movie nights, cuddle up on the couch with that blanket. All right, I'm gonna jump in the shower. I'm cold.
bucket, I just leave the girls' clothes there and that's their chore to like put them away, put them away in the drawers. Oh, and Nazoni did tell me the truth. She did make her bed. Did you really? Oh. Look what's coming in the little egg surprise. Rainbow Dash. I'll just keep their curtains closed. Awesome! Done! <sighs> Me and Nazoni's gonna be doing this school 2016 premier reading challenge, school reader record form. It just, they have to read 20 books before the 26th of August. That's when this has to be handed in. Um, and I'll just hand it to the teacher. How cool is that? So I'm going to, it's whether they read it, you can read them a book, they can like listen to you read a book, it doesn't have to be them reading. Just gets kids more into reading and Nazoni's really good, like she's really picked up on her reading so I want to keep her up. <laughs> Bigger book. She's at level 14 and she's just reading them too easy. Like, I know when it, something's too easy for her, and there's only uh, is one that needs to be challenged. It keeps her mind busy, and she's one that needs to needs her mind to be kept busy. So, I like... Yeah, even her spelling words. She was getting 15 words accidentally, but they would... She was doing awesome on them. Like, I would much prefer her to do 15 words than 10, because the 10 that she's been given is just way too easy. So, um, and she's getting most of them right. Like, she'll get 9 out of 10, 10 out of 10, 8 out of 10. So, yeah, but, well. And she's getting her maths. She's getting her addition and subtraction. Thank the lords, man. That was a struggle. I sat down with her for a good, like, hour and a half. Just giving her five simple sums. And if she got them wrong, she had to do them again. And listen and listen and but she just wasn't listening to me and then I used bribery I used something like if you get these right you'll get an ice cream or something like that something that she loves and then she finally listened to me and she got them all right I'm like oh my god like sitting here for half an hour was not even necessary I should have used the ice cream excuse bloody in the beginning thank you because I really didn't want her to struggle with maths I'm not looking forward to times tables and like division because I suck with that kind of stuff. I suck with maths. And it's like the worst subject ever. Like I wasn't even learning maths at year one. What they learn in year one is just so extreme. Like, like yeah they're young and they soak it all in but <laughs> that's too young. That's too young man. Did their school banking. I'm going to make, my, oh, I was going to make myself a coffee, but now I don't. I'm going to get my healthy crackers. My healthy crackers. I don't think I have any Avo dip left. Oh, I think I've got a little bit. A little bit. In bed. I'm relaxed for the rest of the day. Actually, I'll put that washing on that's on my ground. I need a washing basket for my bathroom. But there's nowhere to put it unless it was to go out here. My bloody um, phone alarm didn't go off for today. I help out today, right? Tuesdays? I help out Tuesdays? Why is my alarm not set? Come on. Ugh. Man. Bloody sore, eh? <laughs> Alright. Let's do this! Just gonna take a little break and eat some 
direction. Oh. Yo. I can eat some shit, eh? <laughs> but then I can eat healthy. I don't know if I want to, though. Some parents get here way too early. It's just gone on two o'clock and these cars are already sitting here. And the parents are sitting in the car waiting for their kid. No. Go home. I just scored myself a GoPro Hero. Um, I just picked it up off a dude for 130 bucks. Nothing's wrong with it. Good condition. Yeah. Jump in the shower, the girls are in bed. First, I'm just gonna quickly clean up this mess. And yeah. When it comes to bedtime, Yozoni just does not go to sleep. Even Koda, they just don't stay in bed. They always have to get out of bed. I don't fucking get it. Like, I get so angry and they see that I'm angry, but they're not threatened by it at all. Like, I growl them and I say, go back to bed. But it's like, that's nothing to them. Like, I don't scare them. They don't listen because... But they listen to their dad. Why? Because he's a male, he looks scary, and he's got a sore smack. That's why. My smacks don't do anything to the girls. They're like used to my hand. I don't think it's hard enough. <laughs> it's just to that point where it's like, I don't want to smack them before bed. It just seems wrong to smack your kid before bed. It's not a nice way to end the night, but oh my god. <laughs> It's so frustrating. Like, Nazoni is still awake now. Uh, and it's nearly 9 o'clock. Their bedtime's 7. And she just keeps getting out saying, I need a drink. I just need to go to the toilet. You haven't kissed me goodnight. Like, every time she comes out, there's a new excuse. Oh my god, I just need help. I need help. Uh, <sighs> it gives me headaches because I'm just like... I need to release. Not happy. She better stay in bed now because I actually did give her a smack. I never smacked them before bed. I'm going to get to editing now. Like this vlog if you haven't already. <laughs> Subscribe if you're not subscribed. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night.